Hi, and thank you for watching another episode of our vlogs again. Right now I'm on the Fort Lauderdale boat show and I've been invited by the captain to uh, show you guys around on Andiamo. Look, 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 look. We are on Andiamo. So this is the captain of Angiamo, Raymond. And Raymond, what's so special about her? Yeah, good morning. Uh, uh, there's a lot of things that are really good about this. Of course, we're 15 years old. Um, yeah. It's uh, uh, a very unique boat. So we're the only ex explorer fed ship for the last uh, 15 years. Yeah, because right now um, we have Sherpa. Exactly. But so before, you were the first, right? Exactly. So yeah. we, we were unique for 14 years and they've just gone and messed it up for us. <laughs> How long have you been on board for? I've been on board her for 12 years. Um, she's great, like any fed ship, great to maintain, easy to maintain. And, uh, uh, you know, 15 years later, we're still looking at a new yeah. boat. Yeah. It, was she your first fed ship? She is my first fed ship. That yeah. is correct, yes. Um, and uh, it's going to be very difficult ever to move to a boat of any lesser stand. We're in the owner's stateroom right now. The owner's stateroom is placed right in the uh, center of gravity of the boat. Uh, so it's the most comfortable place to be. Um, we have the engine room directly behind us. Uh, uh, incredibly, the insulation is such that you can't even hear it through the bulkheads. Here are the people that really work hard <laughs> on the yacht, and how many crew do you have on board? Uh, we run with a crew of uh, eight. Uh, down here, we actually yeah. have uh, accommodation for six uh, in uh, three separate cabins, uh, all with own, own bathrooms, of course. Very, very comfortable. In fact, uh, quite a lot larger than what you'd expect on most yachts, so the guys are yeah, quite lucky. Yeah, no, it's quite, it's quite good here. And what's a super yacht without its own walk-in fridge? Time to go outside. <laughs> uh, the dry store. The uh, great thing about this yacht is we have a lot, of, a lot of underfloor space um, um, under the deck plates. Um, the yacht's designed to go around the world and to uh, be self-sufficient, and uh, so very, very useful that way. Right now we're standing in the bridge and you told me earlier a really cool fact about Anjamo. Uh, the nice thing, or I guess the interesting thing about this boat is uh, uh, we were the first boat or the first yacht ever uh, under 500 tons to receive paper, paperless bridge certification. So that means uh, we don't uh, carry or we don't need to carry paper charts. Uh, we do everything with uh, uh, electronics. It's a very, very modern bridge for a boat like this. Oh, that's uh, quite something, right? Yeah we, yeah, we like it. It makes our job easier. And you do have like the best seat in the house, right? We have the best view, that's for sure. <laughs> you have the best view in the house. <laughs> and then there's one thing that I find really cool in Anciamo is that you have your, well, like your barbecue station here right behind you. Oh, that was always me dropping down. So when you're anchored somewhere in the Bahamas or just anywhere, you can just fire up the barbecue and, uh, and have your own little party here. 